City College was at one time a strong Division I school that dominated New York area athletics and captured championships in various sports. Numerous CCNY athletes such as Henry Wittenberg, Albert Axelrod, Jane Katz, Gina Faustin, and Sheila Ward represented the United States in Olympic Games. Nat Holman's 1950s men's basketball team achieved what no other team ever has or will by capturing both NIT and NCAA championships in the same year. However, budgetary constraints were a major problem in the 90s. Teams were either underfunded or discontinued. Yet the school survived these financial challenges and has started the rebuilding process. Today, City College has competitive teams in fencing, basketball, lacrosse, baseball, tennis, soccer, track and field, and volleyball. In a seven-year span, the CCNY athletic program has produced seven championship teams in basketball, soccer, and volleyball. Many would consider this a great achievement, but not Robert Coleman, the athletic director at City College, who has higher expectations for the program. Five, ten years, I, I see us, you know, if, if, if I could have it my way, I would love to have full-time coaches here. I would love to have that field still with, with you know, new turf, newly turfed. You know, I would love to have that fitness center, you know, going in the, you know, hopefully in the next year, year and a half. Uh, the tennis courts to almost be, you know, if not completed in that five-year uh, period, and to be a consistent, uh, uh, competitive winner. You know that, you know, maybe we're not winning every year, but we're in second place, we're in third place, we're we're competing. Uh, you know, possibly we're going to to an NCAA uh, uh, tournament where, you know, instead of us losing in the first round, we actually get f past the first round. That's what I want, you know. I, I think just just being a competitive, uh, being a little bigger on campus here, where the students, you know, start to have a little more flavor with school spirit. Um, you know, having 100, 150 people in the bleachers, having people interested in going to baseball games or going away games. I mean, that's where we want to be. You know, if I'm still here, this program is going to hopefully continue in the right direction. Um, so that's would certainly be the goal. Some athletes are already happy with where the program is. We, the school and the coaches, administration, all that in the athletic department have done a lot for us to improve from what we were last year. Last year we were a beginning team, a new team, just you know, just starting, and we did pretty good. But this year we have a better chance, better chance to go all the way. Um, the school is providing us a trip to go to Florida in March, which really excites the players and makes us play harder. With hard work and dedication from its AD and its student athletes, there is no doubt that CCNY Athletics will continue on its rise to success. For CCNY News, Jose Lopez.